Hey guys and welcome back to my channel for another cleaning video. This video is a little bit different today. It is a two day major whole house clean with me. I did clean different areas of my home so if you are in need of some major cleaning motivation then I hope you stick around and watch the entire video. Um, if you are new to my channel thank you so much for joining me today and I do hope that you consider subscribing to my channel for more cleaning motivation. My sole purpose here is just to for me, just have a hobby, um, you know, post cleaning videos and motivational videos for you guys to gain that motivation you need to tackle any projects or cleaning around your home. I know personally for me that sometimes I really need some extra motivation to get moving. And if I don't have it, I might just sit there all day and not do anything. So I do really feel like motivational cleaning videos are helpful for people. Um, even if you just like to watch them, you know, and see little projects being done around the home I really do think it motivates us to get up and get moving so that's really important to me too so anyways yeah let's just go ahead and jump right into the video Hey guys, so if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so happy to have you. It means so much to me that you've joined me on this video today, and I really do hope you consider subscribing again. And if you are liking the video so far, then go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. It really does help support my channel and pushes my videos out there so that YouTube knows that, hey, you're liking this content. That would mean 
a lot to me. And I just wanted to introduce myself a little bit. My name is Cheyenne. I'm a stay-at-home mom of four children. I have a 15-year-old, a 12-year-old, an 8-year-old, and a 2-year-old, three boys and one girl. And recently, we had just moved to New Mexico. We did live in Colorado. I'm originally... Actually, okay, let's back up. I'm originally from California. <laughs> Lived there my whole life. My husband and I relocated to Colorado for work purposes. We lived there for eight years and then we went back to California and we lived there for 10 and a half months or so, maybe nine to 10 months. Can't be a hundred percent sure. And then we hightailed it out of there and we are now currently located in New Mexico. So we are renting this home. I do have a recent home tour video. If you were interested in that, I will put that in the cards above and also link it in my description box. So just to be a little transparent here with you guys, it takes a lot for me to want to film a cleaning video. Not that I don't want to film them, it has nothing to do with that. It's a physical thing. I, I'm i going to kind of spill a little bit, a couple of things. I, as we all have, I'm sure, have gained quite a bit of weight. Um, in the COVID time, I didn't think I did until I went to my doctor's appointment and was like, oh shit. So, um, I'm sure you can tell and that's fine. It is what it is. No, I'm not pregnant. I'm just fat. <laughs> so, um, I'm not like hundred percent too worried about that. I mean, I am obviously cleaning really helps me get up and get moving. Um, I also am dealing with a lot of low back issues. I recently was in physical therapy and I have what they call spondylothesis in my back. So it's very painful. And to be honest with you, I've actually been dealing with it for about three to four years total. I was even dealing with it when I was pregnant with my two-year-old Leo. It was very, very painful and it's just kind of gotten worse over the years and it kind of sucks. So just to kind of put that out there, that's a few facts about me. I'm just being honest. I don't have the physical motivation or capability to, con con to consistently film videos like three days a week. I would love to do that. I'm trying to get there, but unfortunately it may never happen and that's fine i'm dealing with it but i feel like any kind of activity or physical activity i can do for myself that everything's gonna help at the end of the day so Me. 
so just a little fun chit chat here you guys may laugh at this it's hilarious but um something that i suggest people never ever do is don't ever buy or rent a home sight unseen and we are not normally those people um however we did do it this one time and reason being is because there are things that are out of our control sometimes and we can't do anything about it so we rented this home sight unseen um and when we moved in here the house only had hot water in half the house it was insane i couldn't believe it uh the sprinklers in the back don't work or in the front the owner actually refuses to fix them so we have to water the grass and take care of the yard at our own expense um the dishwasher leaked it didn't work we had to wait several months uh, not several months like several weeks to get it replaced and we finally did i've been using it it is right there in the video but um the water here is so hard it leaves white film or not really film it's just it discolors the inside of the beautiful stainless steel so that sucks too uh, and all the complaining i did about not having a dishwasher turns out this dishwasher kind of sucks but i think it has something to do with like the hard water i don't think it's necessarily the dishwasher itself the filter in the dishwasher is consistently getting filled up with like crud it's just really gross um so yeah those are a couple of things that happened with the house we did however once we got here take pictures we filled out a move-in report we notified them of everything that needed to be fixed right away so we did do that at least we did something right um we put in uh, repair requests right away uh also the back gate in the backyard was broken so we had to kind of jimmy rig it for a little bit to get it to close because behind our house is an alley and it's another street so it could be potentially dangerous leaving a gate open like that at night like somebody could break in so we nipped that one in the butt way before that was very important to us um so yeah just kind of some <laughs> crazy story about what happened when we moved into this house trust me when we move to buy a home we will never buy a home that we have not seen the area or we have not seen the inside of the home and had it inspected so absolutely something that that's my tip for you guys if you're ever moving or buying or whatever definitely go and visit the place first something else kind of funny about this house well i guess about this city that we live in which i'm not going to name but it's very small eastern new mexico area and they have fly season here it's insane so yeah just flies all the time we can hardly enjoy our back patio because there's just flies everywhere and i absolutely hate it that would be something that would probably make me move but we have not been here a full year so we moved into this house april in april was the move-in month and we didn't have flies here i mean it was kind of cold it was thunderstormy we had we still had like spring you know weather type they also have <clears throat> another fun fact is about new mexico there are a lot of dust storms here i actually got stuck in a dust storm in my car and that scared the crap out of me so there's a fun fact for you if you're looking to move to new mexico i probably would not recommend doing it if you don't like dust storms and you don't like fly season or to live near somewhat near we don't live like right next door to one but um dairy farms because apparently that's a big reason why there's a lot of flies here i thought that was kind of really stupid but whatever it is what it is yeah there's flies all the time it's so irritating to the car on a Friday night. 
have with you Looking for a bar in the nearest town I've never seen a sky so blue And you're taking me
like you're feeling sorry Don't you look at me like that When you break my heart like that Like you're feeling sorry Cause you're not feeling sorry Hey, hey Don't you look at me like that When you break my heart like that Like you're feeling sorry Cause you are 
so fly, you got me like My, my, my You got me like My, my, my You got me like There's no other than you now, babe Nah, 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 cause you got me like My, my, my Like, oh my God This time it's all different, you got every little string on me So fly, you got me like my, my, my You got me like my, my, my You got me like There's no other than you now, babe Nah, 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 cause you got me like My, my, my Like, oh my And that is it for today's video you guys thank you so much for watching i really hope that you enjoyed it and it did bring you some motivation that you needed to get things done it would be so amazing if you would subscribe to my channel as well and sometimes i do get more comments than likes so please make sure you are hitting the like button if you liked this video it definitely helps youtube and lets them know that you are liking this content and it lets me know as well that you are liking it so that i can keep making this cleaning content for you guys so in the comments below please leave me a mermaid emoji so that i know you watched all the way through or leave me a genuine comment telling me what you liked about this video and again thank you so much for watching and i hope you all have a wonderful rest of your week